Hello guys, this is Matrix Ram, and I'm showing you some resolution comparisons between native 1440p versus native PS2. I'm going to be doing some frame rate testing as well and show you the best settings for crash tag team racing. We are using large frame buffer, custom resolution of native 1440p, bilinear PS2, anisotropic filtering 16 times, mid mapping is off, full safest, and configure hacks. We are using 16 times MSAA, and uh, yeah. The game does target 30 frames, so 16 times MSAA is actually quite easy to run. Not all games um, that run at 30 frames can handle this sort of setting, but this game can. Now, there, oh, here we go, we'll quickly show you um, this hack real quick. As you see, MTVU is uh, working for this game, so you can enable this. If you have more than three cores, the game actually, if you have this hack on, it, um, okay, crash is spewing up, or coughing, whatever. Not coughing, it's spewing up. Um, yeah, so what do you call it? If you have this hack on and you have more than three cores, the game has a more consistent frame rate, so you can keep your 60 locked. But since this game targets 30, we're going to be keeping a locked 30 frames, even with 16 times MSAA. So if you can actually run this game with it off, no problem, and you shouldn't have any slowdown. Uh, don't quote me on that, but I don't think you would have any slowdown. Now, this game does target... 640 by 448. Let's have a quick look at it real quick. Oh, whoop. Let's quickly jump up here. We're going to go over here and kill some ninja penguins. I have finished this game, by the way. So I'm just, you know, got my cool outfit. Well, I guess it's kind of cool. Gangster crash. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, let's quickly... Let's do some racing real quick. Before we do some racing, I want to show you something that um, I'm going to show at the end of the video that actually has an issue. Now, when I go to native 1440p, you can see that Crash has got some weird shadowing around him. As you see, the shadow is not really emulated correctly. But, by the way, the game does look pretty nice at 1440p, as you see. Hmm. Yeah, I really like it. Alright, let's go, to, let's go to do some racing. Let's speed this up real quick. Oh, uh, ignore the slowdown in that menu. It is a bit slower, unfortunately. Alright, so now, if you do do racing in this game, unfortunately, this game has the exact same issue where the shadow on the car is not... Yeah, I'll speed up real quick. Uh, I'll show... There's a ramp up ahead, actually. There it is, right there. Ready? Here's the shadow real quick. Ready? When I jump... Do you see that, um, oh, that was not a good showcase. Anyway, if you do racing and you jump, the, um, what do you call it? The shadow is kind of broken as well. Let's go back here. Oh, game froze. Ah, uh, there we go. Back to normal. Oh, yeah, there's one thing I've got to mention real quick as well that this game does have is if you do come across, like, a massive freeze, like a, a five-second solid freeze, I have no clue what causes it, but just let it do that, and the game's working again. It does, like, every 10 odd minutes. Uh, now, if you want to stick to around the end of the video, um, for people that are curious to get that shadow to work, there are two hacks that can make it work, but they don't work, unfortunately. If you go to configure hacks, if you read this, so is it alpha? Yeah, dif um, different alpha handling can work around some shadow problems, we want that on. And alpha stencil improves many shadows which are normally overdrawn in parts, may, can, like, may affect other effects. So, oh whoops, I'm supposed to turn that on as well. But anyway, at the end of the day, the frame rate held up quite well in the racing. There we go. Yeah, see, look, the shadow's back to normal again. Well, it's actually back to what it was just before. There's no way to fix it. So if you guys know a fix, I mean, let us know, I guess, because it doesn't really bother me at all anyway, but it's just there. So yeah, the game's frame rate held up quite well at 16 times MSAA. Looks, game looks absolutely beautiful at 1440p. That's it, really. Um, yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. See you later.